Hello folks and welcome back to another Wise Game of Video. Today we're going to be doing a little bit of tech talk. That's right, but it's not too technical. So in other words, in this video we're going to be covering Windows 10 if you want to change or disable. It's, it's mainly going to be about disabling the password to log into your computer system each day from the welcome screen going onto your desktop. Sometimes people change their mind, they, they realize that they don't need a password. So, um, so we're going to show you how to change that, and then you could also use these steps. You just have to reverse them or whatnot if you do want to able it or whatnot. So let's get started here. Just follow my cursor, and we're going to go down to the very bottom left of my taskbar down, down here, where you would normally go to like restart or whatnot. And then just right-click on that icon, and then go up to Run. Click on Run. And in run, you have to type this word right here or this phrase or whatever. And it's N-E-T-P-L-W-I-Z. Once you've done that, you just hit OK. Now, this is going to open up this screen right here where you have user account accessibility and changes to your password uh, and things of that nature. So as we can see right, right up here, that I already have mine set up to use a password each time I come into this computer system. Now, if I want to shut that off where I don't have to use a password each time I log into my computer system, what I would simply do is just uncheck this box. All right, now that's not just it. You have to do a little more than that too. Now, once you hit apply, it's going to open up another little screen here where you have to type in the password that you've been using, confirm it, so let's just do that. Then we're going to hit OK. Now normally, but I think it's because I tested this a couple times to make sure that it worked and it did work for me. Normally after you hit the apply, another little screen is going to come up asking you if you want to restart your computer system. So if that does not come up, just manually do it like you would normally do. Now, I also have to add that, of course, I can't show you all these steps after this point because it's going to shut down my system where I cannot run my recording software. So there's no way for me to capture this in the recording software. So right now you would just hit OK. And then you would go to uh, restart and restart your computer system. Now. The first time you do this, it's still going to prompt you to put in a password when you come to your welcome screen. So after you do that, let everything load up on your computer system like you normally would. Then go back, restart again, and then it should not. But you want to also make sure, though, too, that now that you disabled using the password, is that you don't touch any, uh, you don't press any keys. Like when you come back to your welcome screen, it's going to take a couple of minutes for it to load because it just made changes. Just let it load up. But normally when you would put in a password, when you came to your welcome screen, you would press like the enter key and then type in your, uh, your password. But now you don't have to. Just let it load up, do its own thing. Don't touch the keyboard at all. And then eventually it's going to open up and just take you right to your desktop that we're looking at right now. All right, so that's how you bypass the password or disable it in Windows 10. Thanks for watching, Wise Gamer. You have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye.